Hi guys, happy Thursday. Um, it's Thursday, I'm so excited. Um, I've got a lot of fun things to tell you about. Um, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you a few products because, real quick because I wanna talk to you about something else. Um, okay, so, all right, well, first of all, you, I know I've mentioned this before, but my fingernails do not like to be painted, um, but I painted them yesterday, so whenever I paint them, it's like a real treat. So I painted them yesterday. Can you see the color? It's called You Don't Know Jacques and it's by OPI and I'm so excited about this. I've mentioned it before on here but I'm just really excited. So that's what it looks like on. It's like a, it's kind of like a gray, it's really dark. It's like a gray brown. Love it. So excited. It's great for fall. Um, it's been sort of uh, warm this week. Like yesterday I think it was like up to 80 or 85 or something and then today the high was this morning and it was like 50 something and now it's like slowly getting cooler. So it's like cozy time in here. We got the nail polish. I got the fire going. Look, check it out. I've got my snow boots on <laughs> that I mentioned last week. And uh, I'm drinking this. Okay, this is Ghirardelli chocolate mocha hot chocolate. And it has a little bit of coffee in it, so beware, there is caffeine in this. This is not like when you're watching the baseball game at night and you want a cup of hot chocolate. This is not the thing to drink. But it does taste really good, so I drank it this morning. Love it. Okay. So, those are just a few things that I'm enjoying. Okay, now for the real stuff. Actually, I want to show you one more. Do you mind? I have to get it, though. Look. Okay, I put this on my mantle. It's a snow globe, but look at it. It's like a tree. It's a white tree. Isn't it so cool? This is like my favorite thing. I've been wanting a snow globe, and I found this when we were in Chicago. We went to West Elm, and I found this, and I was so excited. It was probably a little bit more than I would have necessarily spent on a snow globe at any given time, but I was feeling it, and we had the money and the budget, so... I bought it and I think it's so beautiful. I love it. Okay. So anyway. Okay. On to the exciting stuff. All right. So you guys know Bob is my husband and business partner. Okay. I am so glad I married him. Oh my gosh. He is, well, not on top of being just like a, the best husband a girl could ask for. Um, he thinks totally different than me. And I need that so bad because, you know, I would rather go to lunch and then go hang out with some friends and then go for a walk or a bike ride or something like that, but he loves things like putting together spreadsheets and, you know, doing something like putting together pie charts and stuff like that. Um, you know, he gets really excited about stuff like that, and I need him in my life for that reason, because I hate that kind of stuff. I think there's nothing more boring than that, but it's necessary. So I, it was, it was so great, because we got to talk about my side. A lot of times we talk about some of the other things going on in our business, and this was like focus time on Rose Alamo, Mode, and I was, I, it was just really, it was really fun. Um... And I got a ton of ideas from it. Okay, so this whole thing honestly stemmed from, I was looking at the Emerson Made site. Have you guys been there? I'll put a link up. It's pretty amazing. I've been talking about it a lot lately, I think, because I have been getting really inspired by it. What I love about it is she does not, it, it's like she doesn't look at selling you clothes the way anybody else looks at it. So some of her pictures, I mean, well, that's what she is. She creates clothing and then she sells it. She's got a little blog on there, but it's like, you know, updated every few weeks. It's not like, that's not her main focus. Her focus is selling clothes. So she's the maker, she's the model, and I mean, they've got a staff uh, working for them. Um, but basically what's... What it is, is she, it, it's just her. Like, she's the brand. And you see how she, 
I don't know. I just, I, I, it's like, I don't know how to put it into words what it did to me, but it honestly, like I told, I told my friend, I was like, it makes me want to rethink my entire life. And that might be a slight exaggeration, but it really was making me think, well, why do I always do this this way? Why don't I try doing something like this? So this is like, I mean, really making me question a lot of things that I've been doing. Um, and honestly, I've been questioning things with my site for a long time. For like probably the past month, I've been questioning things with my site. Not because I don't want to do it at all, but because I'm just like, I want to keep things fresh. I want them to be interesting and I want to enjoy what I'm doing and I want to be inspired by what I'm doing. Not that I, I feel like I just said that I don't enjoy what I'm doing because that is not at all true, actually. I really am enjoying what I'm doing, but I want to be more inspired by what, what I produce to give to you guys. So that being said, um, so that's why this whole thing, that's how this whole thing started is I've been like, you know, what should I do? And then I started seeing um, Emerson made and I was like, she doesn't think about things the way everybody else thinks about them. Well, how can I apply that to what I'm doing? So, um, you're going to, you're going to start noticing some changes around here. If you haven't already, I mean, I, one of the things that, so, so I talked to Bob about all of this stuff. One of the things that I really wanted to do, and I've wanted to do this since the beginning and I haven't done it because I didn't want to, I didn't want to burn myself out and I knew I couldn't sustain it, but I've been wanting to, post more than once a day because for me, I don't know how you, how you guys feel about this, but for me, I love it. Like I know Jill from good life for less. She posts more than once a day and I look forward to both of them. It's like, when is she going to post again? Well, I know her schedule, so I don't really think that, but I'm like, what if she throws in like a little surprise post or, you know, I, I love that. I love the surprise of getting to see more than one thing that's going on with her. So I'm trying to become the site. I'm trying to make Rosal Mode the site that I would want to look at. So um, I I have been posting a couple times this week. I think twice every day this week. Um, and I'm just going to be looking. The way I'm going to do it is I'm just going to be showing you guys things that. Um, uh oh, sorry, my puppy's here. I don't want her to drink my hot chocolate. Um, I'm going to be showing you guys things that inspire me, okay? So I don't want this to be a site where you never see my face. Like, you're, I'm still going to be very heavily incorporated in the site. I'm not turning this, I'm not totally changing directions on the blog at all. I'm keeping my outfit posts. I'm keeping the Thursday Lately's. I'm going to keep doing those things. But um, I feel like I am limited in how I can be... <laughs> how I can be. Come here. Say hi. Hi, everybody. Okay. Go away. She's distracting me. Okay, so I feel like I'm limited in how I can inspire because I am limited in, you know, expressing myself, which I shouldn't be, but I am. I mean, you know, we all do this. We all have things that it's, it's like, you know, I, I am not, I don't dress like the people in the J. Crew catalog all the time. I, you know, sometimes I would like to, but I don't. So I'm going to be showing you things that I think are really cool like that. So if I find a picture in J. Crew magazine, I'm going to show it to you that I think is awesome. Um, so it's going to be more stuff like that. Hold on. Bella, climb. Bella, climb. Climb. That's my signal to her to get in her space and get out of mine. <laughs> we have a really well-trained dog. Um, okay, so I hope this is making sense. Um, I just, I'm really excited because I feel like I am viewing the site in a new way. And, um, like, I've, I still want to keep the things that are, are have kept me stable this, this far. I mean, I love just, like, straight inspiration blogs where they just put up pictures of things that they find that they love. Um, but I don't want to just do that. I want to keep Thursday Lately's and the outfit post because I want to still connect with you guys. I feel like that is so important. But I just, I don't know. I want to be more inspiring for myself. And I want, I'm hoping that this is translating to you guys and being 
uh, a better resource of good ideas and things that you know you love and I'm gonna try and tell you what I love about the things that I post so that it can translate to you so I'm super excited about this I hope you guys are too give me some feedback I would love to hear what you guys think um, cuz I'm just really excited I hope this is gonna be like a terrific transition for all of us or not a transition. I'm not, I don't feel like I'm transitioning. I feel like I'm adding. I feel like it's going to be a terrific addition for all of us. And, uh, yeah, that's it. So happy Thursday. <laughs> um, I'm going to see you guys next week cause I love Thursday lately's go to Be Bex's site and check out her Thursday lately's cause hers are awesome. And that's it. All right, I'll talk to you guys later.